We're so glad to be with you today. Very glad for this moment in time. Your earth is shifting very rapidly. Are you noticing? Are you noticing the higher energies that are present on your planet? as the waves of ascension are continuing to pour light over you. The reason we bring this up first is because it's very important that the humans continue to recognize that they are shifting, that they are changing, that who they once were and the modes of operation that they once used They're changing. You are aligning to the frequencies of the new earth. And as you continue to let your mind frame, grasp how new you really are. If you would just let go of your old patterns and your old ways of seeing the world, You would see all that is new before you. And this would help change. This would help shift your perception and how you see yourself. As the world has shifted, the new earth being template has been heavily activated within. And we want to continue the light workers and way showers on the planet to continue deepening their understanding of these new energies. Be present with yourself. Dive in deeper. Allow yourself to get into these heightened frequencies and meet yourself there. You are very different. Telepathy has been activated within the third eye of humanity. And there is new communication that is coming online. New communication with your guides that is coming online, but also new communication within your soul. The memory of who you are. The substance that is in your DNA is worth more than all of the precious metals on this planet combined. In a way, precious metals on the planet, being mined and harvested, is a sort of distraction. Because what is within the DNA is what everybody really wants. That's what they really want. And everybody has the opportunity to continue to open up their light, to continue to express these heightened frequencies. There is no shortcut, though. There is going to be a point where you are going to have to self-reflect deeply. And then there is going to be a point where you will need to really understand what you want from this experience. And then there is a point where you understand that you are the creator. And from there you begin to control your manifestations. From there you enter into aspects of yourself that really understand self-mastery. As earth changes, your natural blueprint will ripen begin to show itself more freely. Continue leaning into the new vision of who you are becoming. There isn't a pressure on this place. There isn't one thing that you need to understand or figure out. But you do have to find a way to really unravel the thought programs that have made you maybe fearful, guarded. 
there is a continuing of this unfolding that allows your consciousness to soar into higher levels of understanding, understanding things that are much deeper than your earthly realities. The consciousness of humanity is now coming into a pool of energy that is going to allow them to understand what could be life outside of this earthly realm. That is a very big movement for humanity. For a long time they have been told that there is nothing but them. And this has fed the egoic planetary structure and allowed them to ignore any soulful purpose, diving deeply into the physicality, pulling them further away from the higher aspects of themselves. But as the light is poured into the planet, the ties of humanity in this matrix are dissolving. You can feel it all around you. And as this is happening, those who have awakened are going to seek out higher frequencies of understanding to begin to allow that coding to download within. Please know each time you shift your awareness on any theme in your reality, you are allowing a more full, expansive light to be received from your genetic coding. All of the information is within you. All of the information is within you. We are asking humanity to go higher. We are asking humanity to continue to let go moving closer to their hearts. The world that is coming is something that most can't even comprehend. Mainly because what is is so loud, but also because they haven't allowed themselves to even think of what a world based on freedom and love, respect, soulfulness, even looks like. But as you allow yourself to envision these frequencies, allowing yourself just to be in your imagination, you're going to meet this new earth energy that is there present in your surrender. And in that you will continue to open yourself up to new information. These new frequencies will become physical isn't that how manifestation works? Everything begins in the energetic realm. And as the frequencies of it become stronger, it moves into the physical realm. This is happening now on many levels. It is good to trust your heart, Slightworker. You do know what you are doing. You have moved through many, many seasons of doubt. Confusion, not really knowing what exactly you are to be doing or how you are to be doing it. And wasn't that the beauty in all of it? As you came to understand that there really wasn't a right way. It was just you finding your path back to truth. You have unlocked it. You have unlocked it all. And the light will continue to pour in. Please allow your crown chakra and your third eye chakra to play in the expansive energies of the higher dimensions. It is a very profound thing at this time 
to allow these frequencies into your body. It is okay if your ego attempts to make sense of them. They will not be able to at first. They may associate some of these higher frequencies with some positive feelings, and that is okay. But a full interpretation won't be available in these downloads immediately. In these downloads, there is a peace, an understanding of how the information is constructed, coming back together within your own psyche, connection to the God Force. This is a very profound thing that a lot of light workers and way showers have a difficult time allowing to come through their vessel. What we will ask you at this time is how do you allow yourself to be in your light body? Do you really believe that the source field that creates all things didn't allow for a gateway or an opportunity for you to move into self-mastery before any energetic shifts happen on this planet? so that you can embody what it feels like to be an Ascended Master of planet Earth. Yes, there is energies that are coming to shift this planet, but those who have awakened at this time have awakened with a purpose of aligning themselves to these waves of light before they even enter the field of the planet. That is a very divine mission. It is a very divine mission that your soul took on, knowing that you would come into this density, knowing that you would have to trust yourself when everything that you have been taught has said never trust yourself. Seek others' counsel. Follow the rules. Yet here you are, against the grain, breaking the cycles, allowing yourself to be in truth, allowing yourself to be in contact, allowing yourself to be embodied, reminding this world that this aspect of you is natural, natural, that embodying your soul is natural. And that from that place, all desires come into physical form. You are here to transcend the families and the generational trauma that you took on coming into this life. It was a contractual agreement because your soul knew that it would need some of these experiences to relate, to rise above. But your soul also knew that by taking on the genetic coding of your family and transcending that lineage and breaking those cycles, you would allow for the ascension to web through the generations, going all the way back to ancient civilizations and allowing the generational trauma of Earth and her history to also heal. Many light workers have gone through a massive clearing. And this is because the phase of the ascension on planet Earth that is coming is one where many ancient civilizations will come forward in the hearts of humanity to heal. You will need your balance at this time.
the ancient days, the old battles of power. You are healing this energy on your planet. hidden histories and suppression. You are healing these energies on your planet. Civilizations will thrive because of the work that you are doing. Everything is being illuminated, light worker. And there will be more information that will come into the forefront than you could even imagine. The human psyche believes that it has only been here through one timeline. And as the information of timelines begins to unfold on your planet, and you understand how long many have been here. They will change the passion in the hearts of many to continue to transcend the density that has once embodied earth and humanity. So many beautiful transformations. Allow yourself to be the vessel of light that you came here to be. Continue to open up to the higher expressions that are coming within you. You are the new earth being. You are. And the healing is done. And the activation is done. You must only step into yourself now. We will say it again. You, listening to this, must only step into yourself now at this time, now at this time, in this timeline, in this moment. No fear. Step into yourself. What does that look like? Move your daily habits. Move your routine. Allow yourself to be new. Allow yourself to be embodied. There is no other time than what you are experiencing here. And if you allow yourself to begin to embody here and now, you will move yourself away from frequencies of waiting and you will begin to receive more of the light that you are asking to come. There are so many dynamics to the creation of what is happening on your planet, collectively, individually. The microcosm, the microcosm, and all of it together. There is a beautiful orchestra of dynamic energy from the experience you are in right now and many experiences that have been lived that are connected to you in some way. And all of it is being transcended. Please remind your mind, this is a phase of receiving. This is a phase of bringing back the divine feminine energy and learning how to receive the beautiful new earth codes that you have embedded in this grid. Everything is unlocked. Do you know how to let it in? Many light workers are deliciously good at giving, 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 giving. It 
It's time to get deliciously good at receiving. And this is not selfish, and it does not take from another. It is an energetic mode of operation that allows you to connect with the frequencies that you are creating with and begin to allow in the physical manifestation, allow in the reality. The things you have been learning throughout your process of awakening are stored, they are within you. You are walking a caution library. Access this information and begin to utilize it now. The energy on the planet is different. The energy on the planet is here to support you. Here to support your expansion, your evolution of consciousness. Here to support you being the light, the light, the light, the way shower. that you came here to be. And you cannot be concerned with another or getting it right. You must only be concerned with whether or not you are in alignment with your truth, with yourself, with who you know you to now be. And you will become more and more and more. But now who you are in this expansiveness, let it in. Be. Your communities are waking up. We have been telling you that you are being prepared. any moment. Things will always be evolving. But at any moment, there is a deepening in this shift that changes anything, everything that you've ever thought that this future of planet Earth could look like. You're ready. At this time. Thank you for being with us. Thank you for the love that you bring into this space. It is found. And love changes everything. Keep going.